Engineers Jesse Whelan and Ben Eady set out to recreate the animatronic hand named Thing from the series Wednesday. The core of the design consists of lightweight metal components and a system of servo motors that control the fingers, enabling smooth and natural gestures. Modern microcontrollers were used for operation, allowing for complex motion sequences. The hand's movements were carefully designed to convey emotions and interact with the environment, just like the original character. For the exterior, a detailed silicone shell was crafted to mimic the texture of human skin. Special attention was paid to visual effects. Every stitch joint and tiny texture element was hand-painted to create the impression of a real human hand. This meticulous approach ensured realism and fidelity to the portrayal of Thing in the series. The Russian company Promobot shared a new video showcasing the process of creating robotic humanoids. These robots are designed to interact with people in various fields, including business, education, and service industries. A standout feature of the showcased models is their highly realistic appearance, closely resembling human likeness. The video highlights key production stages, from forming facial details to final assembly. Special attention is given to details. Skin texture, facial expressions, and features are meticulously crafted to make the robots as lifelike as possible. These human-like traits help build trust and facilitate interactions with people. Key features of Promobot robots include facial and speech recognition, enabling them to identify individuals and engage in dialogue, autonomous navigation with built-in sensors to avoid obstacles, and integration with external systems for performing complex tasks. The American magazine Wired released a feature where journalists detailed the process of creating hyper-realistic masks. These masks mimic human faces so accurately that they can deceive both people and surveillance systems, making them a remarkable technological achievement, but also a potential source of risk. The creation of hyper-realistic masks begins with taking a facial cast using materials like alginate or specialized silicone. After the initial mold is removed, the silicone base undergoes meticulous hand finishing. At this stage, the artist adds skin texture and paints fine details such as moles, freckles, and even veins to achieve maximum realism. The functionality of hyper-realistic masks is diverse. They are widely used in film and theater to transform actors' appearances and create unique characters. Additionally, these masks are employed by intelligence and law enforcement agencies for undercover operations. However, their high quality and realism have also caught the attention of criminals who use them to conceal their identities and evade surveillance systems. Modern technologies are increasingly utilizing robotics to create humanoid machines that strive to replicate human appearance and behavior with high accuracy. These robots are being developed in facilities and laboratories worldwide, including companies specializing in artificial intelligence and mechanical systems. For instance, at the production facilities of Engineered Arts, Robots are created with incredibly realistic facial features, the ability to express emotions and interact with their surroundings. Some of these machines can mimic emotions, respond to human actions, and even display facial expressions. At such factories, engineers design complex systems that enable robots to function effectively in social and professional contexts, whether in customer service, educational assistance, or medical rehabilitation. Special emphasis is placed on studying the perception of these machines which helps improve their design and algorithms for more natural interactions. A creator from the YouTube channel BSFX showcased the process of crafting a hyper-realistic silicone face mask, starting with making a mold and finishing with the mask's final detailing. In the initial stage, a mold of the model's face is created. Materials such as alginate or specialized silicone compounds, which are safe for the skin, are used to capture every detail of the face, including pores, wrinkles, and skin texture. Next, a rigid form is produced, serving as the base for subsequent steps. After the mold is prepared, high-quality silicone is poured into it. This silicone is both elastic and durable, with special pigments added to achieve a natural skin tone that closely matches the original. Once the silicone sets, the process of hand detailing begins. The artist meticulously adds skin textures, veins, wrinkles, moles, and other unique features using specialized paints and tools. This stage is where the mask gains its hyper-realistic quality, as every detail is refined to perfection. To complete the process, 
hair such as eyebrows, eyelashes, and even stubble, is inserted by hand if it is presented on the original. These masks are used in film for creating characters, theatrical productions, photo projects, and even in crafting dolls or mannequins. A team of engineers from the Tokyo University of Electrical Engineering has unveiled their new humanoid robot named Yui, marking a breakthrough in the field of hyper-realistic androids. Yui is designed as an avatar capable of imitating human emotions, movements, and interacting with people with high precision. Yui stands out for its realistic appearance, achieved through the use of synthetic skin that closely mimics human texture. Beneath the skin lies a complex system of microactuators and sensors, enabling the robot to replicate subtle facial expressions, such as smiles, raised eyebrows, and even realistic eye movements. Yui supports interaction through a VR system and is equipped with a unique mobility platform. The robot's eyes feature cameras with a 200-degree field of view. The control system includes a virtual reality headset that synchronizes the operator's head and eye movements with those of the android. Renowned blogger and streamer Kai Sanat recently became the owner of a unique humanoid robot named Neo, developed by 1X Company with a price tag of $50,000. This robot has become a true sensation, and Kai actively incorporates it into his videos and live streams. The 1X robot showcased numerous impressive capabilities, including assisting with household tasks and interacting with people. For instance, in one episode it helped Kai brush his teeth. Additionally, the robot participated in dancing, surprising viewers with its coordination and movements. A standout feature of Neo is its ability to perform simple social actions, such as handing over objects, mimicking human emotions, and even engaging with guests during streams. Thanks to its high price and innovative design, Neo has become not only an entertaining addition, but also a technologically advanced element in Kai's content, inspiring millions of his followers to explore the world of robotics and artificial intelligence. The Chinese company Rowanyer has reached a new level in creating realistic silicone suits that allow users to drastically transform their appearance and adopt an entirely new look. These suits are made from medical-grade silicone, providing realistic skin texture and anatomical accuracy. Every detail is meticulously designed. The suits feature natural facial characteristics, realistic facial expressions, detailed pores and wrinkles, as well as proportional body elements like the chest, hips, and buttocks. They are easy to use, comfortable for extended wear, and accommodate a wide range of body sizes and shapes. Additionally, the materials used are hypoallergenic and skin safe, making them suitable for prolonged use. Ronier's silicone suits find applications in various fields, including theatrical productions, public performances, themed parties, and personal experiments with appearance. These products offer users a unique opportunity to fully transform and experience a new persona, making them highly popular among a diverse audience. Write in the comments what you liked most after watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave a like. Goodbye.